finishes in the most spectacular manner. I'm Pablo Andujar and I jumped over 1,600 spots. in the ATP rankings in 2018. 12 months ago, something very special happened in Morocco. After a career-threatening elbow injury, Spain's Pablo Andujar was finally back playing the game that had been his life. I had uh, three surgeries in my elbow. They were pretty tough for me mentally, but uh, in the third time, the third surgery was the one the good one. I worked a lot in the gym, with physios, with doctors, and finally I don't have any pain. So it was mentally very tough, but now I'm very, very happy. Two years struggling with failed surgery were a huge test, but during that period, his sporting life was put into truer perspective. I got married in 2016 and got my baby in 2017. It was very good for me having my first child, my first son, and marrying with my wife. That was very good because it opened me a little bit my mind and made me think about that tennis was, was not my whole life. That new outlook would help Andujar's long recovery, which began with a breakthrough victory on the ATP Challenger Tour. And then in Marrakesh at an ATP 250 he'd won twice before, Andujar rediscovered his very best tennis on his favorite surface. My breakthrough moment was probably when I won my first Challenger in Alicante and then, then the week after. That gave me confidence to, to get to the, to the final and win in Marrakesh. That gave me a lot of confidence to believe in myself. And holding the trophy made me think about all the people that were surrounding me, helping me and taking care of me. Still now, it's very emotional. A moment Pablo Andujar will never forget. And having battled so hard to make it back into the game he loves, he's relishing every minute. My goal for the rest of, the, of my career is being healthy and fit. I don't, I don't think about the rankings, just enjoying tennis, enjoying uh, these great tournaments once again, and I just, think about every day and being healthy and fit. Next week on ATP Uncovered, stand by for the first 1,000 on the clay. Monte Carlo steps into the spotlight and Rafa Nadal aims to make more history. And a man with big plans, we've part two of our special feature with Croatia's Borna Cioric. Don't forget to log on to atptour.com and chat with us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. See you next week.